Hello everyone, I'm Red Herring and I'm here to distract you. Welcome back to my Football Manager 2023 series, non-league to top league. Uh, I do apologise a little bit about the last episode, um, me losing my little temper uh, there. Um, hopefully I'll be a bit better today, but we have got two very difficult games. As you can see, we've got Chelsea and we have Arsenal. Um, after the last episode uh, where we lost to we drew with Leicester and lost to Wolves we did then beat Burnley played a couple of friendlies got a good result against Tottenham then lost uh, Liverpool with a ridiculous offside goal managed to beat West Ham then got pretty much battered again by Crystal Palace we've played a couple of friendlies a nice 8-0 uh, and then a 0-0 which is a bit worrying but it's okay so the form's not bad it's just when I've gone from the, that sort of form and then losing two games like that, it's a bit frustrating. Um, but we're getting to the Chelsea game, who are currently second. So I don't imagine us uh, winning this one uh, today. Um, little few changes. Um, we've got Holmes playing. He's played quite well. Gill's come in. Um, Corozo, Corozo, Corozo uh, is playing in it. And actually, Harvey White has been playing really well as this deep line playmaker. So I'm going to keep him in. See how he goes. Uh, other changes to the tactic is we've put the fullbacks now on stay wider. And we've just got this is a back to a support uh, central midfielder, but just get further forward. I think that's the only other tactical changes um, I've done. Um, but that's the team for today. Um, so let's get into the game against Chelsea. We are at home, but we are going to play the counter fluid. Um, tactic it done okay in the two friendlies um, so we'll see how it goes um, but they are doing quite well at the moment Chelsea lying in second place so as you've seen we are still sticking with our 4-3-3 a bit of patchy form um, that we're in there um, and Chelsea a um, bit patchy I guess you could say for their standards and they're playing a 5-3-2 I would say uh, you see their joint points with top of the table man City, um, and we're lying in 10th. Still not too bad in 10th place. Um, so it really seems we're supposed to be relegated. Uh, one of the favourites to go down. So I can't complain too much. And we're straight away off with a highlight, a kickoff highlight, which I'm not comfortable with. Um, unless somehow we magically nick the ball. Uh, but I can't see that happening. Or maybe we have. Holmes has it. Finds Adam. No, he can't find Adam in the middle. Middle. Uh, Conte, oh, Adam's intercepted it, been fouled, no, no, but if that was us, that would have been a red card, oh yeah, alright, nice bit of passing there from Chelsea, um, hopefully we can get the ball back, which we haven't, because uh, they've got the ball down this right hand side with James, close him down, close him down, Good save in the end from Danny. He's been playing quite well actually in the last few games. He's got some good ratings. He has made himself number one just because um, uh, Mickey decided he would play absolutely awful this season. Um, and then I had enough of him. Um, he then said he's not happy with how I'm treating him. Um, and then he wanted to go. So I saw, I'm gonna, we're selling him. And he's been sold. And Adam should be scoring that. You're in good form, Adam. Should be scoring that. You ain't going to get many chances like that against Chelsea. All right. All right, we have a kick, goal kick. Not a very good goal kick, but come on, Boris. Track back, track back, Boris. All right, that's good enough for now. Go on, Gil, get him. All right, they're playing the ball out. Nice ball through to Sterling, who's going to get across in now, but he's about to chill. A well, good block there from Holmes, I think that was. Block the shot. Oh. All right, shout some encouragement out to guys. Imagine Chelsea will be all on top of us. Um, but I will be happy with a draw out of this game. Does mean we might slip away from Leicester and Brighton might catch us. Um, but if we draw against Chelsea, that is a great result. Home or away. Right, home is doing a bit of shuffling there, which is good. Oh, get a tackle in someone. 
Oh, I think Nathan got a tackle, but it just went straight to Kai Havertz's feet. Ah, that's a shame. Let's watch this again. We probably should have intercepted it here. We've done a little bit better like this. And then, yeah, he blocks it and it goes straight to his feet. That's a little bit unlucky. Oy. But as predicted, they're going to be completely on top of us. We just got to hope that we can just make it not too... Uh, not fire as much. But not expected to have loads of shots. We could take a risk and go to the more attacking formation. But I think at the moment we're not doing too bad with this. Um, I would like our team to close down a little bit more often. or get a bit closer. I don't understand why we don't get so close. A good ball in. And is that took a deflection, which is upset the keeper or has the keeper just made an absolute howler after I just said he's been playing so well so have another look at this uh, through to Sterling Sterling uh, back to to well he shoots yeah I think it took a deflection off of Nathan again oh he's having a terrible game isn't he Nathan bit unlucky yeah he's playing at a six point try and encourage him again if they score third, I think that's dead and buried. But I don't think we deserve to lose three 0 This is what irritates me. We we'll get we we'll get battered for no reason. Oh, I got nothing to lose. I must just go to the the, the ticky tacker now. We're three 0 four 0 It doesn't really matter. Five 0 doesn't really matter. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, we're good to that. Make some changes. These two are knackered, so let's just take these two off. Um, Nathan's having a terrible game, which is a shame, because he's usually really good. Uh, you're having a terrible game as well. Uh, we'll save one just in case we get an injury. I want. I was expecting to lose, but to get back at 3 0 is a bit bit naughty really, I think, of the game. But hey ho. Does confuse me then with my tactics and then it just makes my players. See so they played really well in the friendlies. And they've played well against Liverpool with this tactic. They played really well with Tottenham in this tactic. And then I mentioned my keepers playing well, and of course we get destroyed. So I'm not happy, so I'll throw my arms at him, but I won't throw the ball. We weren't expected to win. Still very disappointing, but... <sighs> I suspect we're going to get two very disappointing results today. Right, um, I will see you at the start of the Arsenal game. Welcome back, everyone, uh, for the second game of the episode. Um, hopefully, a better result today. Um, Arsenal aren't doing very well this season, but they're still a very good, very good team. Uh, they're three points behind us. <clears throat> um, I am going to take a risk and play more a more attacking um, tactic um, this game because of we're at home. Arsenal aren't uh, playing particularly well. Just noticed that you are injured. Um, so we're going to try and play this. Uh, brought Manny in um, because the guy who was playing there went out on loan, which I didn't realise I still am on the loan list. It's a bit of an error by me there. Um, but this is what we're playing at the moment. Uh, the only thing I think I took off was um, stay on feet, and I've added uh, lower crosses, I think, since the last episode. Uh, last episode, last game, uh, even, sorry. So let's get into this one. Hopefully about a result today. Um, might be a bit of a gamble going with the more attacking tactic because I say they are Arsenal, they are still a very good team. Um, so we are lined up with our 4-3-3. Uh, three, three. Uh, as you can see, the form is not particularly great. 
Um, and Arsenal are lining up in a 4-3-3 as well. Um, their former looks a little bit better than ours, uh, but they are currently lying two places below us, three points um, worse off. Uh, so skip this and get straight into the game. So hopefully because we're a bit more of our attack of tactic, maybe we will control possession um, of the game. Um, but we'll wait and see. It looks like we've started on top. Um, but that always happens and we end up then conceding the first goal. Um, nothing so far. Um, usually try and show, show out my in encouragement. Uh, we're completely, completely on top at the moment. Um, but we'll probably get nothing from it. Um, we're coming up to the 40th minute already. Wow, it's flying by. No highlights so far. First highlight. Hopefully this is a goal. It would be excellent to get a goal now. Oh, I did Adam not score? Oh, and then Ramsdale has got like glue on his hands. Oh, we should have scored. Should have scored there. Uh, the other thing I did, sorry, is I switched the wingers um, uh, around. I'm going to say that. Oh, nothing. So nothing G's them up. So we'll just shout a bit of faith at them. Uh, that G's them up a little bit more. Um, and hopefully we can come out and win this. Harvey White to whip a ball in. Uh, where is our centre backs? And why is Harvey White taking it over that side? I prefer a right footer to be taking that. Don't get counter attacked from a bloody corner. When Arsenal have not really been in this. Good, we got that. Don't be silly. Yeah, that's the keeper. Good out the Chambers. Chambers has it now. Gone a little run, Chambers. Quite good at him sometimes. Nice ball through to Holmes. Holmes finds Adam. Adam. Oh, Ramsdale. No, he, he put it wide. It looked like Ramsdale got us, uh, a foot on that. Shout some more encouragement out to the boys. Completely on top of them, really. It looks like they're slightly getting back into it, but I'd be so annoyed if we lose this. We've been really the better team. Nathan nearly got turned. Someone get him. Someone get him. This is going to be a goal to Arsenal. They've not even been in it. It's going to be a goal. I can feel it. Oh, maybe not then. Maybe a bit of luck. All right, they've made a couple of changes. Maybe we should look at bringing some people off in a second. Gill got no chance of getting sat. I don't even know why he's attempting to get that ball. Everyone seems a bit out of position, which means they're probably going to score now. Usually is the case. Go on, Adam. Adam, nick it. Oh. Go on, Adam. You had that then. You could have had that. Oh. All right. Arsenal are slowly building themselves back into I don't like this. Chambers with the ball, but poor clearance. Get on him. Get on him. Get in. Oh, you had the chance to get the ball there. And um, we're giving away a fucking penalty. Oh, this is a joke. This is an absolute joke. <sighs> oh, he saved it! Saved it! Saved Danny! Right, we'll look at making some changes in a minute, I think. Go on, Danny, collect that beautiful. Having a real good game this time. All right, coming up to around the 70th minute. Who You are getting tired. So let's bring on you. Uh, do we take Nathan off? Because he's not playing amazing. No, we'll leave it for now. Gil's not having the best of games, so we'll bring Filippo on. Uh, we'll do those for now and see if we can just shout a bit more encouragement out to them. We've been the better team. Look, we've been on top. We've got... Well, we ain't got the better XG. they got the better XG, but I think we've been pretty good this game. Don't think we deserve to lose. A win would be nice, but don't think we deserve to lose. Why do that when we've got all our big men up front? And then pass out to a centre-back. To the other centre-back. What the hell's going on? What are the awful choices there? Two, both our centre-backs trying to do that. 
Gonna get a draw, I think. It's not a bad result, but I think we deserved a little bit more out of that. I really do think we deserved a bit more out of that. Uh, that's a shame. That is a shame. Not a bad result, but I wish we had. I would say uh, they're unlucky today. Oh, they don't like that at all. Maybe I need a shower. Maybe they don't like it when I'm nice to them. Um, I'd say a slightly disappointing result because I think we deserve to win that one. Um, joint points for Southampton. Now still ahead of both Brighton and Arsenal. But if we keep losing and drawing, and we have got Man City coming up next, so it's probably a definite and never loss. We will start falling down the table, which I don't like. But we have Villa next, um, and then we have Man City. I will come back for somewhere around here, just before the transfer window. Um, it may be Wolves-Leicester. Um, and then we will see um, what we do, what I can do through the January transfer window, and then we'll come back from the other side of the January transfer window. But not a great episode. Um because of the big loss to Chelsea. Bit disappointed that we only got the draw at Arsenal. Because I do think we slightly edged that game. But um, everyone, thank you for watching. Uh, please don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe. And I'll catch you again soon.